hi. I never thought <laughs> my entire social media career I would ever have to talk about what I'm about to talk about. Because I kept it who is my mom who took me from birth and raised me into the person that I am today but yes fuck you to the people who leaked the video about my story that I wasn't ready to tell that's why I wasn't posted that I trusted with and asked them if I should post it months ago but then I had a conversation with my mom about it and she told me that she wasn't ready for people to know because it hurts her and she's crying right now because she's so hurt that I, people were going into her life saying she's not my real mom when very much she is she may not be my birth mom but she took me from birth. She's raised me my entire life because my real parents didn't want me. My real mom and dad are dead. It's really fucked up for a lot of you to say that I would have chose I would have chose drugs over her too, because that's not okay. I don't do drugs for that reason because both of my biological parents were addicted to it and chose me over it. So I don't know why you're starting those rumors saying that I do drugs, because my dad died of a drug overdose and my mom was murdered. So, basically, I hate talking about this, I wasn't ready, but it's out. So, I'll tell you my story. My real mom, Melinda, who is my birth mother. And so did my dad, Billy. Billy is Debbie, my mom now. That is her brother. That is why me and Debbie, my mom, look alike. Because I look more like my dad than I do my biological mother. So Melinda and Billy made a dumb decision and got her pregnant and she tried to have abortions with me and her and Debbie, Mama Laverne would stop her and tell her that when she has the baby that she will take her that she will take me and it's her own and that she doesn't need to have an abortion or not take care of me. My real mom wouldn't eat so Mom Oliver and Debbie would have to feed her every day, find her on the streets, try to give her a home so she could have me kept there safe with me in her stomach but didn't want to do that debbie my mom now took her to court and won me as her daughter my i don't even say she's my adoptive mother because she's a mother to me she's always been a mother to me she took me from birth because my real mom did not want me at all. She wasn't ready, even though she had like six other kids, which are my siblings that I've never met before. <laughs> Only met two of them. 
after I was born, Debbie Mama Laverne, who is my mother because she took me from birth and has been my mom since the day I was born. She's the one who helped me, not my real mom. My real mom didn't care. She didn't, she wasn't ready to take me. She didn't want me. And Doug, my dad, is my dad because he took me. Hold on, I'm live. Because he took me too. Can you guys, can you guys go in the, can you guys do it downstairs? Can you guys go downstairs, please? Yeah, sorry. It's okay. Dude. Just come in here, Just go in Amber's room and shut the door. Honey, I'm so sorry. <sighs> Doug, who is my dad, my adoptive father, which is my real dad, because he and my mom, Debbie, take, have taken me from the start, have raised me, gave me a home, fed me. Because if it wasn't for them, I probably wouldn't have my career right now. I'd probably be somewhere else in the world. And I'm very thankful that my, which Debbie is actually like, in reality, my aunt. She would have been my Aunt Debbie. So I'm very, very thankful that my aunt decided to take me in as her own so I could still be close with my family and know my family. But I wasn't ready to talk about it and it was really disrespectful to the people who leaked that video without my permission when I told them that I didn't want anybody to see it because I didn't want to talk about it just yet because it's not something that I like to talk about. It makes me very emotional. And I don't like people hating on my mom, Debbie, and telling her that she's not my real mom when she took me from birth because she is my real mom.